Officials are using new drones to prevent the spread of infectious disease. An epidemic of dengue fever continues to spread in Kaohsiung and Tainan. Prevention strategies focus on reducing the population of disease-carrying mosquitoes. But many mosquito breeding grounds are in hard-to-reach spots, difficult for humans to patrol. So new drones and robots have been developed by the National Health Research Institute in partnership with aerospace engineers. They hope the technology will be able to target mosquitoes precisely while reducing the demand for labor. A disinfection squad carries out a dengue fever chemical prevention process dressed in head-to-toe protection. But many locations are hard to access or dangerous, and those are the blind spots where the disease is often transmitted. So the NHRI is working with aerospace engineers to develop a new dengue fever prevention drone. How can we look down with a mechanical eye using a drone in the sky, at the same time carrying a heat rod to find places where water has accumulated, using temperature readings and spraying chemicals and applying other prevention techniques on hot spots? It can save a lot of labor. A drone flies into the air. It can reach a rooftop easily and help locate pools of water and to apply chemicals, reducing labor requirements and monitoring mosquito-related data. <laughs> Meanwhile underground, the drone's top detector light shines on a patch of accumulated water and you can see the mosquito larvae wriggling. This sewer drone moves through the pipes with ease, relaying instant images and detecting the breeding grounds of disease-carrying mosquitoes. It can even perform safety patrols in hotspots. In the past, we would use manpower to patrol the sewers, which was quite a large expenditure. People also miss things. We can use sewer robots to patrol step by step through the sewer and see where the breeding grounds actually are. As the epidemic of dengue fever spreads, these sewer robots and drones are helping provide city residents with another layer of protection.